Silenced. Oh man, is that going to prevent me from using the stones? Witness perfection. That's a lot of magic missiles. It's a lot of magic missiles. Orpheus is almost down. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Orpheus. Did they just kill Orpheus? Healing vapors. Heal everyone first. Where's Will? The blade will not bear Okay. Healing duty. Needs to move a little bit closer. There we go. Hide behind, hide behind, Lazelle. Choice, but to keep going. Joy, Mika. They silenced me. Hold on, let me try that again, because they. They silenced me. Get up there. Let's go, Gale. All right. Now we stall. He's fire, eh? Fire? That's fine. I don't care. What? Haste. He's, he's fire, so it doesn't matter. Let's shield ourselves. Dragon's not...
Oh, the Emperor's not invulnerable, though. fight the dragon or should I fight the emperor? I think, I'm wondering if I hit the emperor, if the emperor, I'm wondering if I hit the emperor, if the em if the dragon will stop. I don't know, but we'll give it a try. Basically, I'm just stalling. Soul breaker. Go, Lysel, go. Goading attack. Go, Lysel, go! Menacing! Action Surge! Menacing Attack! Come on! Goading Attack! Come on! Yeah! The Emperor's down. You're next, dragon. You are next. Um, telekinesis? I want him to throw him down at the dragon. Get him away from us. Cunning words. Nice. Defend me, Gale. Thank you, Gale. Go after the dragon next, Will. <laughs> Topple the big foe. Nice. Also, I should probably make myself resistant to fire. Just in case. Now lacerate him. Yes! Fleeting dream. Storm of Mist, you can teleport. Uh, it's fine. You can cast you can cast Fleeting Dream if you want. That's fine. Sonic Succession Hush? That's okay. No 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 no. We're not. We're not doing that. Counter spell. We're not silencing Gale. In Hush on cord? Heck no! Don't you dare! Don't you dare silence me! Okay, Lysel can take it. She's, she's a big girl. Ooh, get 
It's okay. We're okay. We're okay. Please do not hold cord. Oh. 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 Will. Will. Oh my gosh. Will's dead. We gotta resurrect Will. Hellish Rebuke. That's annoying. That's annoying. Come on! Who's next? You punk. Compulsion. Okay. So the cone's magic control the cone and come in. That's must channel this effect until the next turn for it to take effect. Okay, so we need to protect him at all costs. This is an action. of invulnerability, not enough movement. Fireball. Protect him. We have to protect Cord. Does anyone have any scrolls? I'm pretty sure we have a scroll of... yeah. Scroll of Revivify? Good. Because we need to get... we need to get Will back up. Because I... I don't know if, if we beat the game and Will is not alive, if that's going to mess up the ending. We work too hard for that. We'll work too hard for that. You gotta help tank. Everybody to cord.
Into the... Into there. A little bit of vulnerability. Good. She's got a tank. Yeah. You have to tank. Hush on cord. Counter spell. I don't know if that's gonna stop. I already cast a spell, so I don't know if that's gonna stop him. No, protect cord. Protect cord. Come on, cord! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, 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 please. Please, 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 please. On Orpheus. Command flee. It's okay. Lizelle, it's okay. Oh, Lizelle. Wow, Lizelle took a beat. Lizelle took a beating. Come on, keep saving. Lizel! Trying to. Bomb of Moon Maiden. Call upon healing up to six nearby allies. To do that when we get to Gale. Let's do something else. Iron Hand, Grenadiers, Wardens, Inferno. I don't know if that seems that seems a little too risky. Silverlight, summon Dane Alien, rain down powerful infernal. The watch, Hellrider platoon. Did it work? Did it work? You feel it. A sudden shift. The <clears throat> brain is weakening. Its grasp of itself slipping. This is your chance. Please don't make us roll 30s. Even bound, its will is stronger than anything you've ever felt. The chains shake, threatening to break at any moment. Is this a change of defeat it before it breaks free? Oh, save, save, save. We got to this point. My allies are still alive. We gotta. Bolt of Celestial Light. Nebulous Black Hole. Shatter Psyche. 
15, Strength and Force Tunnel, Perilous Stakes, Augmented Psionic Overload, Concentrated Blast. Not enough movement. Well, so much for peace. has to survive now. Okay, Orpheus. Can't use command because he's fleeing. How are we doing on health? Everyone who needs health healing is over here. Here, you can help tank. You can help tank the dragon. Lizelle, we need you to attack this thing. Goad. Goad it to attack you. Oh, ow! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Fine. Heal us. One, two, three. Thank you. Counter spell. Indomitable. Weapon dropped. Oh, gone it. You are so annoying. At least I took out the Emperor. Oh no, Zevlor. Oh no, Zevlor. Let them actually do something! Let the Hell Riders do something, come on! Warp of Negation? I don't like that. Who's next? Ford. Why am I back out here? Celestial Blast. 
13 to 27 damage. I need Celestial Haste. Actually, do I have a Potion of Haste? No. Potion of Haste. Celestial Haste. Fractured Psyche. Piercing strike. Oh, time for some bloody work. Fracture Psyche. Five percent. Concentrated blast. Can I go in now? Its will is weakened. The brain is almost defeated. Give it all you've got. That's fine. sword. Get everybody inside. Will can't teleport. So he's just gonna make a run for it. Well, he can. No time to waste. Gonna make a run for it while he can. Ah! Good, good, good. This is our chance. Farewell to the Neverbrain. Curriculum of strategy. Go, Dale! Take it out. We only have four turns left. Flame strike. Thank you. Impossible. 
Flee, boo. Will is hushed, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Come on, Will, you can stay alive, Will. We just need you to hold on just for a few, couple more rounds. A couple more rounds and we should have it. Come on, Will. Survive, please. Ooh, the dragon. Eee. It's okay. It's okay. Ah. Ah. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We gotta get this thing fast. Nice. Can't use commands because he's flee. Give it all you've got. Uh, Iron Hand Grenaders. Attack! Attack again! Almost! Come on! Come on! Lizel. Come on, baby, you can do this. Lizel, do it. Take it out. Lacerate. Boom. Hit it again. Yes. Yes. Impossible. That fight made my, my heart is beating out of my chest. That fight was intense. Shut it out. Let it die. Spare me. No. Join me. No. Wield me. No. Become absolute. Heck no. Command it to die quickly. Yeah, die. <laughs> you heard my husband. You heard my husband to be. Commanded to die quickly. I'm gonna save. Not that I... Just because I'm curious. I mean, this is a pretty critical part of the game. So, I'm just gonna save. Just if I wanted to see what would happen. But right. Yeah. No. No, no, no. In my canon? Yeah. D yeah. Dominate the brain. Become the absolute conqueror of the world. No. Command the brain to destroy the tadpoles and then itself. My master. <laughs> I must. Obey! I must end! Bye! Bye! There's the crown. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! Oh! Hopes 
nightmares and the screams of legions upon legions of unborn mythids. The pain rips through you, obliterating all thought, all feeling. The crown. There's the... Oh, Gail, we did it. Silence. For the first time in a long time, you'll and then gravity, <laughs> and then gravity, and then gravity. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Where's Cord going? Oh! 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 Okay. And there it is. There it is. Nope, nope, stop, stop, nope. Get him. Yeah, fight back, Baldur's Gate, fight back. Thank you. Ooh. Let's go, let's go. Take them out. End their misery. Bravo, Baldur's Gate citizens. Bravo. I wish we didn't have to kill Balder, Balderon, but we had to. We had no choice. We had no choice. Yes! Yeah! Yay! We won! Oh my goodness! This feels so good! Oh, this feels so good. Everything you sacrificed. I'm crying again. It was worth it. For, For this. this. Oh, there goes sundries. Sundries. Sorcerer sundries. I'm sorry. Sorry, Roland. I'm sure we'll rebuild. We'll help you rebuild. So now, what about the crown? Take a moment, savor our victory. Long may the coast winds carry our names. It will, you're a hero, man. You're a hero. It's over, it's truly over. Yeah. My mind is clear, it's burden lifted. When the netherbrain died, the tadpoles died with it. Yes. No offense meant, of course. I can never forget your sacrifice for us. For the city. Yeah. I know. It's alright. I like what I've become. I did what was your scenario. That was very insensitive of you. I, 
don't know if Court's... I don't know if Court can honestly say he likes what he's become yet. I think he just has to... He needs more time to get used to it. It's just a lot of change, because it was a change that he really was afraid of. He was scared of. I think that's why he resisted it so much, is because he just... I think he was just used to being, oh, like, treated like a thug or a stupid half-orc. And um, having to embrace the illithid in him just felt like it was going to twist the knife even more. Because, again, he just worked so hard to be where he is now. <laughs> and um, turning into a illithid, I think, was just really a hard choice. But And he was so scared, but I think that the fact that Gale was there and his Elizel believed in him and just thinking about how scared all of his companions were th when they were given moments of change, how scared Lizel was t to change her beliefs and Shadowheart to change her beliefs and Gale about possibly dying and Will about sacrificing his soul to all in eternity in the hells for his dad and Asterion for Cazador and um, Karlak for not being able to touch anyone and then being doomed to a short life. And, you know, Jahira and Minsk as well for, um, for everything that they've already gone through as heroes of Baldur's Gate. I think Kord got comforted hearing that they had to make a lot of leaps of faith and sacrifices and jump into really scary things and I think it was his turn. He realized it was his turn and it would be very hypocritical of him to to not make the sacrifice and to have to have to ask somebody else to be an Elthid instead. I did what was necessary. I will ensure that all Githyanki know your name and your sacrifice. What you have done today will start a fire that rages across the astral plane. I'm proud of that. I'm proud that I made that choice. I don't... I don't... Their lost prince returned. My people will burn away Vlakith's corruption. And it is all thanks to you. The Illithid who defied a nether brain. And the Emperor and Baldur... Balduron. The best illithid in all land. Make sure you people know that. I'd rather be remembered for who I was before. I couldn't have done it alone. Remember my friends when you remember me. Let it be known to all your people. Not all mind players are alike. To be honest, I wish I'd made you. I'd made you do it. No, no, no regrets. No regrets. None at all. I haven't could. I couldn't have done it alone. Remember my friends when you remember me. This is cord. This is 100% cord. As you wish. My savior. I don't think I've ever been this emotional at the ending of a game ever. Not even Dragon Age. Oh, this is very new to me right now. At the end of an RPG, I My mean. My people are leaving, and I must leave with them. It was very well said. We will free the Githyanki and dismantle the Empire. Let them be imprisoned no longer. I'm proud of you, Lysel. Your duty is to your people, Lysel. Go with Orpheus and lead them to freedom. You have new purpose here, Lysel. Stay with me. Let us craft a new fate. No. 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 I think I've grown to really love Lysel a lot. It took a while because I remember when we first met and it was just... We were just not... We didn't set off on the right foot at the beginning, but... We just, we grew to have an understanding with each other and we helped ourselves grow and we pushed each other to be the best that we could be. And um, when you care about someone so deeply, you have to know to let them go and just let them fly. Fly like the comet, Prince. So Lysel, your duty is to your people. Go with Orpheus and lead them to freedom. It will be done. I will never be free while my people are still bound by Vlakid's chains. Your will is strong, Rastil. Your name will be etched in our slates. You will be called Mlagir, Liberator. Orpheus, 
Thank you. I am ready. Julius! Juthas! Until we meet again, Lysel. <laughs> fight the good fight. I'm gonna miss you. You were the very first companion Farewell. I met. Gestel, she was the one who saved my me. Liberator. She saved all of us. <laughs> the Gibb Yankee saved all of us. <laughs> and she learned how to care. There's the rest of our companions. <sighs> I was wondering if we could when we could see With them the again. With the Githyanki gone, there's nothing left but the silence of the city. Smoldering. Waiting to be rebuilt. Yeah. You are a mind flayer. The very thing you sought to eradicate. Whatever self you possess is quickly ebbing away. Your friends and enemies alike are ripe for manipulation. And if not manipulation, then consumption. Soon you will not be able to trust yourself at all. You will be a monstrosity beyond redemption. Or not. Perhaps you are unique among illithid kind. Perhaps you will retain enough of who you are to resist your nature. I hope so. A rogue mind flayer. Like the Emperor. I hope so. The risk is certainly yours to take. Will you? You're a mind flayer now. You have never been so wise, nor strong, nor cool. Embrace it. You will survive, but you'll be ready to take your life if you feel the slightest loss of control. Trust that anything fine. How could it not be? There should be no mind flayer roaming freely, not even you. Put yourself in prison. The risks to others to great. Take your life. I don't know if he would be ready to say this. You will survive, but you'll be ready to take your life if you feel the slightest loss of control. Trust that everything will be fine. How could it not be? Cord is very naively optimistic. He has to trust that everything will be fine. You have thwarted the Illithid Grand Design. You have defeated three Chosen and a Nether Brain. You are miraculous. And you have earned the right to live. Your fate will be what you make of it. Now you are your own master. But it seems that Gale's mind is elsewhere. The crown. It's somewhere in the Chiontha. Yeah. If I salvage the stones, I can reforge it. Yeah. With the crown in my hands, I would be unstoppable. The casts I weave would be mine to command. I would be more than the greatest wizard who ever lived. I will be a god. We'll be gods together, Gale. I'll be right by your side. Is that what you really want, Gale? Such power was not meant for mortals, Gale. You should give it to Mister, like she asked. Is that what you really want, Gale? Want, need, deserve. Choose whatever word you prefer. Okay. But it is what I'm going to do. Okay. Good to know. Mistra has dictated the terms of my potential for long enough. The crown would grant me control of my own destiny at last. Okay. Think of all I could achieve. All that I could grant to those whose ambitions are restrained by Mistra's yoke. I could raise a new netheril. Right here in Faerun. Don't forget me, your god. We'll be gods. Yeah, I think what's really cool is that... Um, if Cord is worried that he'll become a danger to people, Gale, as a ascended god, could be one way to stop him. Either cure him or prevent Cord from hurting people and completely giving in to the illithid tendencies. Or, if it really comes down to it, destroy him. Destroy Cord if if there's no way to 
stop him from hurting other people. But he'd like to believe he can trust Gale. He can trust Gale. Just like Arsis tried to stop, or at least thought he was helping by stopping Bal Baldurin. Good luck, Gale. Don't forget me when you're a god. We'll be gods together, Gale. I'll be right by your side. Your hubris was your downfall once, Gale. I thought we were wiser than making the same as again. Don't do it, Gale. Stay here with me. No, we'll be gods together, Gale. I told him I support him and I trust. I told Gale that I trusted him in this and I will support whatever he decides is right for them. So I'm all in. We will be gods together, Gale. I'll be right by your side. That day cannot come soon enough. But first, I must retrieve the crown. Have patience a while and I will return to you. Carrying immortality in one hand and offering you ascension with the other. I will be a god. As will you. Good luck, my love. I shall miss him. Though I hope he proves to be a kindly god. I would like to believe I've so. I've had my fill of the tyrannical sort. Yeah. Though I hope he has the metal needed to face Mistra. She will not yield willingly, I fear. Yeah. A new chapter awaits. Let us make haste. So... What comes next? We party. We party. Since Gale's not here, Will can cook again. I'll stay in the city. The world could use a mind flare with good intentions and a mind flare's intellect. I'm a mind flayer. Do whatever I please. I think it's best I find somewhere to go into hiding. Let's get out of the city. The Underdark calls to me. Nah. Thinks I'm pining me part ways. No, 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 no. I'll stay in the city. The world could use a mind flayer with good intentions and a mind flayer's intellect. Were it any other mind flayer, I would put an end to this right now. But I suppose you have earned the benefit of the doubt. I just saved your, your butts. I honestly don't mind what we do once we get to the... Ow! Asterion. <gasps> Asterion! Oh no. Get under No, Asterion! Oh god! Get, no 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 no! Well No, Asterion! No! Asterion! No! I have to go! Go underneath something! Go underneath somebody cast We will find you, Asterion! And Boo will bring a sunflower! Not funny, Minsk. Not funny. Yeah, like no! Somebody get an umbrella! Quick! We Carly. did it, soldier. The city's going to be all right. And so are you. Thank you, Carlac. Oh. Oh no, her fire. <gasps> Carlac. Uh, no. Engine's finally cooked. No, Carlac, no. No, no Carlac, please, no. So Oh, Carlac, no, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I love you so much, Carlac. <laughs> no, no. You did what you needed. It doesn't matter. It's over now. You were spectacular in every way. Carlac. So are you. <laughs> my friend. My companion. No. Okay. I I adore you too. You're such a good friend, Carlac. Careful. Hot. There was really no way. I never gave up. I know. I did my best. I did my best. I couldn't figure out how to save you. Uh, it's the one thing I can't beat, isn't it? I wanted to live in my city. I know. With my friends. I wanted that for you too so badly. Oh, my dear Carlac. Goodbye, son. Goodbye, C. Carlac! Goodbye. No! No, stop. I won't allow this. Carlac, you're coming. <gasps> Will, please save Not her, us. please. We can't let her die. Not like this. No, Not I, now. I don't want to lose any more people. We'll figure something else out. You just have to try, Carlac. Go, Carlac. We'll be with you. Will will be with you. 
And you can have mad sexy times. You can have mad sexy times with Will. It'll be on the awesome, it'll be amazing. And you'll have wonderful sexy babies. Sexy infernal babies. Oh. And you won't be alone anymore. You go, Carlec. Will will be with you and you won't be alone anymore. It's your decision, Carlec. You have to choose. Will will go with you. Zariel won't be able to touch you. Enough, Carlec. The three of us will make a new life in the nervous together. Will, you've done enough. It should be me who goes with Carlec. You can still live, Carlec. You do it together. What do you say? No, Carlec's made her choice time and again. She's ready to go. Go, Carlec. Will will be with you and you won't be alone anymore. So, what do you say? Please. Die here now. Or live on with the blade of Avernus at your side. Yes. Zariel won't touch you. Yes. I swear Please it, go with him. Fine. Thank you, Lou. Please. I'll go. Well, with you. Thank you. But we have to go. Now. Take him, Will. Take him, please. I can't hang on much longer. Take care, please. Oh my goodness, all the drama, all the beautiful drama. I didn't see Minx go, where's it's Minx? Over. And it's all because of you. You, who were destined to become a thrall. Thanks to you, there will be no illithid empire, no death god's tyranny. You have earned your place amongst the legends of the Sword Coast. Oh, Balderon. You are the saviors of Baldur's Gate. Carlac. Well, soldier. That's a good pairing. I, I ship them. Here we are. It worked. My engines calmed down. I shouldn't have let you come here. This isn't going to be easy, you know. Zariel's going to come at us with everything she's got. Gods. Like clockwork. They'll be on us soon, but there's just enough time. I trust the two of you to be to, to protect each other. <laughs> Thought I was done with these. <laughs> oh, I love this. But then, there was you. Oh, yay! Carlac and Will. This makes a it lot of a sense. Fast, but careless. Don't let them tie you out. Just get rid of them. And don't forget. You asked for this. Better let these fuckers know I'm back. And this time, I'm not alone. Yes. 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 Oh, I love this so much. I love this so much. Wow. Wow. That was, that was amazing. Oh, wow. I, I just, I don't even know what to say. Oh my goodness. That was amazing. That was so amazing. And the good thing is, I can see so much replayability in this game. Like I've only scratched the surface of all that there's experience to experience in this game. And I've, I've clocked like 200 some hours or something ridiculous like that. Yeah, I think when I saw how much time it's actually spent on the game it was like close to 200 hours, which is insane, which is pretty much up there with, I think Dragon Age Inquisition. For the longest time, Dragon Age or Dra uh, Dragon Age Origins, for the longest time, was my favorite RPG of all time, and especially within the last, you know, twenty years, Dragon Age has been my favorite, and it 
I didn't think it was going to happen ever in my lifetime, but Baldur's Gate 3 managed to bypass both Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age Inquisition as my favorite RPG of all time. This is just my opinion, of course. It's just the level of, the, the amount of detail, the amount of attention, the, the fact that the developing, the developers at Larian Studios clearly, clearly care about the players and clearly try to please the players and give them what they want, give them flexibility. There's just so many things about this game, so many ways you can play it, so many ways you can, creative ways that you can solve different quests and missions and scenarios and problems. So many different ways you can build your character, so many decisions you can make. You can be good aligned, you can be bad, evil aligned, chaotic, neutral, uh, lawful, everything in between. There's a lot of things that I that I can see that I, I, I'm, it's still going to be fresh when I play this game a second time, a third time. I, admit, at minimum, of course, would love to attempt to do an evil run. I typically don't like to do evil runs in games, but this game is just so rich that I feel like I, 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 I it would, it would be very, um, it would be genuinely rewarding for me if I played a evil run, just, just for, for funsies. I do feel though that a lot of the evil stuff that happens when you are evil to certain characters, especially characters that you probably would like, is brutal. Super, super brutal. So I don't know how well my heart can take it, but I'll give it a try. Um, but I also want to play other playthroughs um, that are not necessarily evil. I know that there's a there's so many backgrounds. You can play as Gale. You can play as Asterion. You can play as any a lot, almost all of the companions as themselves as the main protagonist, and it changes your experience in the game. You can also play the Dark Urge, the Evil Urge, the Dark Urge, I think it's the Dark Urge, which opens a whole other can of can of story that you didn't get in my playthrough when I just did a vanilla, gen you know, a vanilla generic. Not, there's nothing generic, there's, Cord is a lot of things, but generic ain't one of them. Um, you know, a, 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 a standard, this sounds really bad too, a, a non-urge background character, or a non-origin character. I'm really happy that I did do the origin character because I thought it gave me, a, it, it was allowed me to discover the backgrounds and backstories of each of the other companions, which I would have wanted to do naturally, organically, through the eyes of my own genuine creative character. So I'm glad it did that. I think my second playthrough is going to be a Dark Urge playthrough who's trying to still be good. And then my third playthrough, ooh, the music, oh, the soundtrack of this game, man. I'm gonna have to look up the soundtrack. Um, and be a, a evil, evil character for like my third playthrough. Because um, we, I, I know that, for example, there was one companion that we didn't, we didn't um, recruit, which was Minthara, I think is her name, which is that paladin, that drow paladin that we killed during the at the goblin camp, and so I definitely feel like there's a lot of cool things with her that we just never experienced. See, there's just a lot of things. There's just a lot of stuff. Neil Newbin, Asterian, Jennifer English, Devora Wild. Theo Solomon, Tim Downey as Gale, Samantha Beard, Matthew Mercer, Tracy Wiles, and, and more. Um, f fabulous job to all of the voice actors, not just the main cast, not just the companions, but everyone did such a good job, not only in the voice acting, but in the motion capture, for those, those of the characters that did motion capture. This was just such an immersive experience. Um, they just executed so many things so well they knocked so many things out of the park i'm still reeling over the romance um the gale romance stuff and i'm sure i'm not going to be disappointed by any of the other romances i had a sneak peek of halson so definitely excited to to romance him properly in one of my future playthroughs um the one thing the one downside that i would have loved to have had is to have Something that sort of tells us what happened to what happened to each of the other characters. Like what happened to what ended up happening to Isabel and um Isabel and Nightsong. Um what have, what happened to to Bar uh, to Barkus? Uh what happened to Maul and the 
and the other tiefling kids? What happened to, um, you know, what happened to Minx and G uh, Hulson and all that good stuff? I, I want to know more about about those, even if it's just like the end of Dragon Age Origins, even if it's just a slide, different slides that have different texts of what of what happens to them. It would have been really nice to, to have that. Um, and then the other thing that I, one small critique is, I kind of wanted to see the actual ascension of Gale. Like they, they were building up this whole thing about Gale getting the crown and us becoming gods with Gale and we didn't actually get to see it. I guess maybe they were trying to open it up to your interpretation of what that would look like and how that would pan out or or but I don't know I would have wanted to see it and especially if you're um oh Alex Jordan I know it's Alex Jordan too is a voice actor uh, I would have wanted to have seen that just to tie everything up in a nice bow especially if you're in a romantic relationship with Gale I want to see you as god husband and wife or excuse me god husband and husbands god husbands um in with whatever they end up doing like that would have been just icing on the cake um because i did feel like it's just sort of ended abruptly and i like how things ended with will and will and um uh carlac but i would have preferred that the final scene the final final scene before the credits ran i would have preferred it to have been with cord and gale um, because that's Cord is the main character and Gale is is the main character's romance, so it would have been nice to have ended things on that note instead of Carlac and and Will. But it's okay. It's just it's just okay. I just I expected there to be, you know, I, I expected there to be just be a better way to just end the story right there with the final scene at minimum being cord cord being in the final scene and not you know not one of the side characters they're not side characters but not one of your companions that at least wasn't your romanceable companion um but yeah so i think i've said about everything about everything else um love 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 this game i don't think i've ever gotten this emotional in an rpg ever that i can think of I don't, I mean, I'm, I have been emotional with other games for sure, but in terms of an actual RPG, I do get emotional with them, but I don't think I've ever cried this much. I don't think my heart was wrenched or s strained nearly as much in any other RPG, including Dragon Age Origins, including Mass Effect, including, you know, so many other games that I have played. It, it was just so well done. It was well executed. Obviously, there's it's not perfect in terms of bugs. Um, we definitely caught some really annoying ones, and some of them that was really almost crippling that kept us from fully like realizing the story, which is a danger. But speaking of the story, I I, I wonder how much of the stuff that's on here is actually canon in the Faerun setting books, like. Is it canon that Balderon actually turned into an Illithid? Is it canon that he ended up imprisoning uh, Orpheus? Um, I feel like there's so many choices that you could make in this game. Like, you don't have to free Orpheus. I did. So I doubt that that part is going to be a canon piece in the Farine's Faerun settings or the Faerun books. Um... But I don't know. I, I, I have no idea. Uh, if, they, if they aren't, then obviously it's a great way to just introduce these twists and turns in the story. Um, when you play this game, even for people who are very well versed in the, in the Faerun and Baldur's Gate lore. Um, yeah, oh my gosh. So good. So good, you all. Uh, yeah, I, I guess I want to just say really quickly thank you so much for watching this is a very long let's play i tried to invest in making each of my episodes an hour long because i know this is a very long game and i know people really wanted to watch my playthrough of it as quickly as possible so i mean typically i do 30 minute 
episodes, but I really wanted to do an hour, like twice as that for all of you. So I hope you appreciate that. Thank you so much for watching any of this playthrough, even if you didn't watch, even if you didn't watch the whole thing, even if you just jumped around, you just bounced around from one episode to another because you knew I was getting to a specific part and you just wanted to see my reaction for, you know, the, the Balduron reveal or the Gale romance reveal or the Holson reveal, like all of that good stuff. Um, even if you just bounce around and didn't even see, you know, nearly a majority, or, or even if you just saw one or two of my episodes, thank you so much for visiting, and thank you so much for watching. I hope that you were able to, you know, get something out of uh, my playthroughs, or at least feel like you don't have to take your, you know, minutes or hours back <laughs> in your life. Um, it really does mean a lot to me, and I appreciate you you know, hanging out and sharing, allowing me the chance to share with you my experience with this game and um, my Chord's story. Chord's story. Um, it's such a great ride. I'm gonna miss my first time playing this game, but there's so many other playthroughs I'm sure in store for me, as I said. Um, and thank you for being a part of that. So... There thou art. Oh, there's more. The dead three. Thy faces, gods. Thy actions, barely worthy of the name. Didst truly believe thy ploy would succeed? Didst believe I would not notice? Thou sought to bolster thy strength by taking away the souls of mortals. But souls vanish when their hosts become mind flares. Didst think the other gods would not notice? Gods thou may be, yet thou hast proven thyself fools, everyone. The supplication of Bane, the whimper of Baal. The death mule of Merkel, felled by mortals. That's right. I overestimated thee. They did not. Vermin, away. Thou wilt trouble us no more. I'm just going to say thank you again so much for watching, everyone. And until next time, love yourselves and love Gail. Bye.